Hello friends, James Corbett here, CorbettReport.com, November 23rd, 2016, and you might remember that just last week we were talking about that 60 Minutes piece on Soros that emerged through an open source investigation, which led me to ask people to submit ideas for the next Corbett Report open source investigation. Lots of uh, ideas in this comment thread, 79 comments so far, but you might remember in that video I specifically said... Uh, Pizzagate might come to mind for people. This is obviously a hot topic in uh, the quote-unquote conspiracy circles right now. But I would say that Pizzagate started in the Donald subreddit again, but actually now has its own subreddit with uh, over 15,000 contributors right now. So if you have an interest in the Pizzagate open source investigation, I'm going to direct you over there. I'm not going to try to steal their thunder because that this is the place, obviously, to be collating and discussing the Pizzagate information. So, well... Guess what? That's right. Pizza Gates banned. Uh, Reddit has banned this community for violation of their content policy. We don't want witch hunts on our site. Well, this is a witch hunt, apparently, to simply look at publicly available information and how it relates to an unfolding pedophile scandal in the ranks, uh, highest ranks of government. So, unsurprisingly, compromised places like Reddit like Facebook, like YouTube, like Twitter, like all of these platforms that are handed to you as the outlets for you to use on their terms are going to ban you as they will um, at a moment's notice. There's more information about the ban in the Donald subreddit uh, in regards to today's shutdown of Pizzagate, and you can read about it. They do point people over to vote.co, that's V-O-A-T dot C-O, a type of Reddit alternative, uh, which now has an ad active uh, Pizzagate form with... 2,862 subscribers and over 3,300 users uh, online at the moment. So this is the locus where people um, are coming to. Uh, basically, I mean, it, it's continuing as if it didn't stop at all. All of this information is being uh, uh, is being collated here. And I, I did see earlier today that there was someone with a archive of the entire uh, Reddit Pizzagate uh, subreddit. So, so the investigation is continuing, as of course it will, um, one way or another, on uh, one platform or another. Uh, but this is a good kick up the butt and a good a good sign, I think, that ultimately I think I've decided, although I did want a different type of open source investigation. Again, I wanted something very limited and doable, but this time it looks like uh, Reddit has made the decision for me. We're going to be talking about Pizzagate on Corporate Report as well, so please do use the comment section of this video on CorbettReport.com to start collecting, collating, analyzing data on Pizzagate as you see fit. Um, and uh, there's going to be a lot of uh, a lot of things disappearing down the memory hole. In fact, I would venture to say at this point, probably most of the incriminating stuff has already probably been memory hold one way or another. But for anything that you do come across online that you think is important and needs to be saved, why don't you save it? Uh, for example, archive.is is a web page capture uh, site where you enter the URL. It takes a snapshot of that web page. Uh, it saves the text and a graphical copy of the page for better accuracy. It's an unalterable record of any web page, and you can use this as a way of saving uh, a, a web page at a moment in time so that you can say that you can show what was actually on that page at that time. A very handy little tool. I'm sure there are lots of little tools like this that are handy for these types of investigations. If you know of any, again, please leave them in the comments on, uh, for this video at CorbettReport.com. Looks like we're going to have to take up the slack because uh, Reddit isn't going to let people do it over there. So um, please do start collating, collecting, talking about the data, and we'll put together an open source investigation uh, at CorbettReport.com. Uh, and once again, don't let this be the one and only place where this uh, is happening. If you can contribute in the vote uh, uh, forums, please do that. If you have another place, if you have your own blog, if you can post your own videos or, or blogs about this, please do so. Get it out in every way possible, not just putting all eggs in one basket because most of the baskets are controlled and can be removed at any time. You have to spread your eggs wisely and anything that you control, your servers on your website is obviously preferable to putting it on a third-party platform of any sort. So, all of that in mind, the Corbett Report investigation on Pizzagate is open, and I'm looking forward, well, I'm not looking forward to the information, but I'm looking forward to seeing what the Corbett Report community can turn up. Thank you for your participation.